People will often ask, how do we lead the industry in high-definition tactical videos using off-the-shelf video equipment? The honest answer is we can't. First we found that the regular cameras weren't cutting it and we asked the Army. Turns out everything they had was too fragile. Then we asked the CIA. Everything they had didn't have enough accessories. So we thought you'd take you on a tour of what we developed as a tactical camera to make our videos. We start out with your standard high-definition video camera. Uh, we give it an OD green paint job for covert ops. Makes it blend right in. It didn't stop there. We add an accessory rail. First thing we add is the Magpul AFG, the angled foregrip. We give it a Glock fading weapons light with laser. And just to give a third layer of tactical, we zip tie a surefire light to the side. Let's take a look at how it operates. Turns on like most cameras, flip open the viewfinder. The AFG gives us a well-balanced ergonomic grip, finger access to the zoom and record buttons, thumb access to the illumination. We can either temporary or click on the surefire light. The Glock has a fading light, so you can see you can fade the light onto any level of illumination or click it straight on to its brightest setting. It also has a laser feature. Why would you need a laser on a video camera? Let's take a look. We've activated the laser and you can see that it shows up in about the lower third of the viewfinder. This way, if we have the camera around a corner or out a window, up in the air, we have a pretty good idea of where the camera's pointing. It's easy enough to turn that laser on and off with either a finger or a thumb on either side, totally ambidextrous. Turns out to be just the right amount of tactical accessories and illumination for us. Of course, nothing's tactical without a field of Velcro, so we have a place to put patches. And lastly, people might ask, why do we let the AFG extend past the camera instead of modifying it and cutting that off? Here's the answer. Sometimes we'll add our pistol grip accessory. This gives us the ability to do really effective point of view shooting videos. Wouldn't recommend using this one in an airport or a police station, however. So that's our tactical video camera, how it operates, and how we're able to bring you some of the best tactical videos on the planet. Thanks for watching.